Hi everyone, uh, this is my first video and I'm going to play the uh, Global Dokkan and new boss rush with this team. Um, is it, I'm free to play so they're a really um, interesting team but the purpose of the video is to like tell people that being free to play is not a, as a bad thing as most people see it as. I've never put like a penny into the game and I still haven't awakened some of my characters, but I'm gonna attempt it anyways. So hope you guys like the video. All right, let's do this. The quality may be bad, but I'm, um, but I'm just trying to video because I like playing this game. I've put so much time and effort into the game, so hope you guys like, like the hope you guys like the gameplay. I would have used a mouse, but um, I'm I'm playing this on my tablet, so sorry. But I just want to enjoy playing the game. I put like a lot of time into it, and I love this game. I play it almost every day. Just hope you guys like. Um, and I'm sorry about the quality. Maybe not as great, but I'm trying at least. But it's just like, people complain and say that being free to play is a bad thing. I have like four accounts. I have like two JB accounts and two global accounts. And I've worked like so hard on them. Like, see, I even have like the new LRGO from the 30th anniversary. I even have a deep on him. And so, I'm just somebody who really enjoys the game. And I haven't like put money into it. So I'm just trying to tell people, being through the play is not a bad thing, and as long as you um, don't give up, you can get like good cards in this game. It's a really free to play friendly game, with like, the characters they release, and it's just amazing. game. And I'm just trying to tell people that, even though you're free to play, it's not as bad. Like, I put so much time and effort into the game every day. And I just enjoy it. I do it for fun because I like the uh, Dragon Ball Z. It was one of, I think, it was like my first or second anime that I watched. But like, it, it's awesome, and I love the fact that it got the new series like Dragon Ball Super. I both I watch I watched both global and the Japanese version, and it's just really fun games play and regardless of whether you're paid to play or free to play you can enjoy the game and I'm completely free to play and I just work on I work on all of my accounts they're all amazing there are times where I can't play certain um, things but I try at least so you know and sometimes you get disappointed from all the stuff you get but you still have to keep trying and be positive. You stay positive and then you get what, what you want or what you might need. Like I even pulled the new Goku from the four, four multis, three multis and a free one. Yeah, I pulled him. I also have him on one of my JP accounts. And I also got Frieza on the same account as the one I got on GoTo, that counts on my phone, but I won't be able to show it to anyone until like I find a way to try and access apps on my phone while also trying to video it. So when I get there, I will eventually try. But like, it's just people just complain about being free to play, and we're just trying to tell people that you can enjoy the game and still be free to play. So yeah. Just like don't give up on it and say, oh like I don't know if I can do it or anything like that. See even my Goku's not even awakened. 
and here I am trying like this team. I used the same similar team um, when I was clearing it and my other global account, but with that team I awakened him already. It's just I'm trying to do all four like develop all four accounts at the same time. So and I'm busy with other things. So I'm trying to make time for it, but I just wanted to get the video out, so that's why I didn't have time to awaken him. Still got a lot of medals to get. But I just want to tell people that playing the game and being free to play is nothing wrong with it. And even if you don't get what you want, eventually you will be able to get it in other banners. Like, I recently even, during the 200 million downloads, I got Ultra Instinct Goku on my main JP account. And then, right after, I pulled him again on the Goku banner, and he has a dude. That account's really well developed. And it's just... I wanted him from the beginning, but I kept trying, so, yeah. It's all about luck. You just, you either get lucky or you don't. But, it doesn't mean you have to give up because you're not lucky on the summons, so, yeah. But true, uh, if I, to, to, to be honest, like, it took me quite a long time to get these accounts to where I want them to be at. It took a lot of time and effort. But I still didn't give up on it because I like playing the game, it's really fun. So my message is like try not to, even if you're free to play, try to stay positive about what cards you get and, and try to say that I'll try to hopefully get them next time, not give up and say I'm not going to get it because I'm free to play. That's like the whole point of the video that I'm trying to like get across people like try to tell people that being free to play is not as bad. Because I've like I've seen a lot of um, people on things that say that being free to play is difficult. But this game is really free to play friendly so you just don't give up. It's gonna be a long video because this new boss rush is really difficult. So hope you guys enjoy it. I'm sorry about the quality. I'm using my phone to video, so it's kind of a, not the best quality. But I'm trying to get the video out there. It'll be like my first ever video, so hopefully it goes well.